I've been all across this country. I've been all across this state. There are a lot of good people here, folks who share the values of, of looking out for one another and doing right by one another. And we've just got to make sure that our politics reflects that. And we do that by voting. We can't just talk. We can't just imagine a better future. We've got to go out there and fight for it. And what we do this week will matter for decades to come. Imagine January 20th, and we swear in a president and a vice president who have a plan to deal with this pandemic effectively, who believe in science, who have a plan to protect this planet for our children, who care about working Americans, who have a plan to help you start getting ahead. All of that is possible. All of that is within our reach. America is a good and decent place, but we've just seen so much noise and nonsense and distortion, and sometimes it's hard for us to remember. I'm asking you to remember what this country can be, what it should be, what it must be. I'm asking you to believe in Joe's ability to lead this country out of these dark times, to help us build it back better. Don't abandon those who are hurting right now. We can't abandon the kids who aren't getting the education they need right now. We can't abandon all those young people who are out on the streets who inspire us. We gotta channel their activism into action. We can't just dream for a better future. We gotta fight for a better future. So what are you gonna do about it? You gotta vote. You've got to vote. So make a plan right now for how you're gonna get involved in vote. Let's bring this home. Honk if you're fired up. Honk if you're ready to go. Let's make this happen.